Hey there everyone, welcome back to MC for yet another video and today we're going to be driving from Czech Republic to Flossenburg in Germany so we're right by the border, it's going to be a lot of fun, hopefully and uh, we're once again driving the Citaho, uh, the DB Citaho and uh, well, hopefully we're going to have a lot of fun together of this one so let me skip time actually because we're way too early still let's try 47 downwards and uh pretty like that that how much better okay so we have one minute to spare they are going at the wrong door which i don't quite appreciate but it is what it is get in get in everyone let's go we gotta keep moving amazing all right, so let's close that, close that, because we gotta go. Oh yeah, bark and break, I think. Yeah, that's the case, pretty much so. Forgetful in it. Uh, that was not it. Oh, that was it. Okay, never mind. Alrighty, just uh, struggling a little bit. Steep, quite steep. Uh, 6295, that's the one we're doing, let's just make sure. There's nobody. No, there's not. We're sh we should be fine. Oopsie daisy. All right, it's gonna be a fun trip. Uh, about what, uh, 40 minutes, I think. Maybe a little bit less, depending on traffic and depending on how we handle the whole thing. If I don't get lost, that's gonna be quite the challenge, honestly. All right, get in, people. Let's get our folks in. Servus. Good morning. <laughs> I wish it would support multi-language because uh, it's probably because the game is just not set up in such a way that it could handle two nations at once. It's generally just for city driving. This map's a little bit too big and it does, I mean, it's not that the map is massive or anything, it's just that it has a part of it which is in Czech Republic and a part of it which is in Germany. So, and the game is not built in a way that it supports like different uh, languages split across the map so that like one part uh, speaks Czech and the other part speaks German. So they all speak German. Which, uh, I mean, being that close to the border, it could as well be the case, you know. Is that <laughs> Chances are they might speak a little bit of German vice versa I guess so not that far-fetched but it would be nice if they spoke Czech I, I think but uh, it's whatever uh, here's the stop Cheb 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 I don't know no clue how to I just say um, Czech words in general as you can tell even this part of the map is brilliantly done. This is a fantastic map. Quite quite the work of art. Honestly, like wow. It just it, it, it just feels like you're actually there, you know. It's very well made. The bus stops. Any changes once you get in Germany, it's a different bus stop. Oopsie. Oopsie, oopsie, that was a little bit... Sorry, I didn't mean... But then again, I'm not supposed to step on the brakes. That's a little bit harsh. Okay, let's close the door. Please close. There we go. And off we go. Simple as that. That was... It was fun. It was a lot of fun. Let's try and not hit the container. Um, there we go, I think. There we go. Oopsie daisy. Now we are in Germany. Welcome to Germany. I think we are in Germany. Are we in Germany? Yes, we are in Germany. Yeah. Alrighty. So from now on, I'm going to try and keep a speed. It's uh, an in-between. I don't want to go too fast, but I also don't want to go too slow. Because the final section is a little bit tricky. 
so chances are I'm going to be spending quite a bit of time there. Now it's very easy to be extremely early, but that changes once you, once you get near Flossenburg. It really does change. Oh, so they don't want to get in now? Yeah, I, I, I assume so. Alright, it's a shame. But it is what it is. So you guys don't want to go with me to Flossenburg. What a disappointment. They're, they're, they're missing out. They're missing out. This this trip is going to be a lot of fun. 6295, so that should be a turn right there. Yeah, that's 6295. 6295. Okay. So, make sure there's nobody coming. Which is definitely... coast is clear. So let's keep on going. Oh yeah, that, there we go. Quite a powerful boss. It, it makes it easy almost. Hello, 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 hello. I uh, should open the back door. I hope he wants to get in. Do you want to get in, buddy? Oh. Uh, hello, hello. Guten Tag. Willkommen. A servus. <laughs> Look at that. Playing OMC for like a couple of hours now and kind of getting familiar with German. I, I just, obviously, it's just a joke, don't take it seriously. Imagine though, like, oh, how did you learn German? Oh, I, I learned it with a buzz simulator. <laughs> Chatting with my uh, pretend passengers. Quite a lot of fun. Oh my god, we're way too early already. Two minutes. <laughs> I think it's uh, uh, it's three minutes when it goes from okay to too early. So minus three too early, minus uh, plus three means too late. Should be a little bit more. Uh, it should be five minutes, honestly. Mostly for this kind of stuff because uh, you're taking an actual. It's an actual trip, you know, it's not intercity, it's not within the city, it's not contained within the city, you actually gotta go and, okay, so we have to, oh boy, that's gonna be hard, oops, sorry, 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 there we go, alright, so we gotta turn right, yeah, that's Hello. about right. Okay, so this is when things get confusing. They get legitimately confusing from now on because uh, it has the little, it has a bunch of tiny shortcuts that you have to take and they can be very misleading. Oh boy, I, I did an oopsie there. But it is what it is. Okay, so we gotta keep Working windows, that's amazing. Most maps don't have that. Alright, so I'm gonna try and climb as slowly as I can because three minutes. Oh boy, we're way too early. Yeah, gotta make some time. She's not very smart with an automatic buzz going through an uphill section, but. Because you really want to keep that momentum going, but if we keep the momentum going, we might as well be way too early. And I don't want that. I want to be right on time. Uh, <laughs> which is, uh, it, it is something that triggers me on on specific maps. Because when you're driving in, in, in a city, it doesn't, it, it's not much of an issue because the red lights are eventually going to hold you back, so you're always going to be within you know, a, a sensible amount of time, you're never going to be too late, but in this case scenario, as you can see, it's kind of hard to control because there's no traffic, there's no red lights, you can keep a constant speed all over, and then it, it becomes quite, well, I guess I'm just going to like, oh, oopsie daisy, I'm going to take my time, I'm going to take my time. Just want to make sure it's within 
three minutes. Not three point four. Otherwise, I'm gonna be too early. I'm just gonna. I'm just acting as if the bus cannot climb, so the passengers don't get mad. I don't want to make it evident that I'm making time. So, oh, I'm sorry. The bus has a problem. Oh, it's a miracle. Look, it's recovering. It suddenly works again. It's a uh, German technology, baby. Benz self-repairing bus. And we're still... Oh, I mean... Oh, okay, 2.9. There we go. There's nobody there. No, nobody wants to get out. So, yep. 2.9. That, that, that is probably going to count as too early, but at this point, I don't care. Then again, it's a sandbox. There's no... There's no consequences for being too early or too late. So, I'm, I, I guess I'm just going to... Oh, my God. Now I'm way too early. Way more than before. And it changed again. What? That's confusing. So confusing. All right. It is what it is, I guess. It is what it is. See Tahoe very fast. Huh? Quite, quite the efficient bus. No, stop! I'm not doing anything. <laughs> yeah, that's the part of the map where it gets complicated because the uh, it is very uh, sharp. Turns are extremely sharp, so what you are not ends up being harsh, and the passengers complain. But I'm really, really trying to go as easy as I can. I'm, I'm really trying my hardest. I just don't. But sometimes there's no way to prioritize comfort. There's just no way. I mean, unless they want me to climb at, like, what, 15 miles an hour? That, I mean, that's an option. I sure wouldn't be early if I did that, but also kind of, you know, counterproductive because we are going to need that margin, that safe margin later on because it does get tough eventually. This is just the beginning. You see, I, 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 I went a little bit harsh into the corner and they were complaining. It gets worse. This is just uh, the beginning. It does get worse. So, uh, not that I care much about their complaints. I mean, I'm, I'm paid to take them from A to B, regardless whether it's comfortable or not. I'm getting paid the same. I mean, ideally, I'll, had it been in real life, obviously. Um, I mean, they could call DB and complain, and I could get fired maybe but I mean realistically I think they would understand I mean had it been real life I, I think the passengers would have the the understanding because obviously I mean it, it is obviously visibly uh, a challenging section which you cannot you can just not not be harsh at times because otherwise I mean, you're gonna be moving at snail's pace. Time is money, they wanna get there early. I wanna get there early as well, so. Oh, oops, I might have clipped a little bit there. It's, it, it's, it's, it's cool how, I mean, I'm not sure whether it's a good thing or bad thing, but there's no traffic in the section at all, which is kinda weird. It feels like there is nobody around. And it's not, it's not a case, it's not that the map doesn't have traffic, because uh, as you've seen from the previous video uh, on that C42 we did, that was 100% not the case. We had plenty of traffic actually, it's just that for some reason they do not spawn here, I don't know if it, it was a choice, a compromise made by the guy that made the scenery, because, I mean, it is narrow. So I assume negotiating with the AI on corners would be a little bit, uh, a little bit uncomfy for most people. I mean, it, it could work, but that would be so much pain. 
like honestly just think about it like it's so tight look at that it's very narrow so that would be quite the negotiation I mean some of the the, the corners are just uh, very tricky without traffic even just by yourself they're kind of tricky to get right and not clip stuff and then you add AI into the mix and just becomes a modern day nightmare essentially yeah I mean it, it is quite fun though I gotta say I really uh, I really uh, enjoy driving this buzz around so many maps so many options you just gotta you know load up drive and enjoy yourself and listen to the complaints in German and they complain quite a lot but it is what it is at the very least they're not complaining about my talking you know because I'm talking throughout the whole thing and they seem to be okay with that which is good because I I assume <laughs> that would be the case in real life you know imagine like driving a bus with a GoPro on and just talking through the whole thing they would be quite annoyed uh, I would I would assume maybe not but I would assume they would be annoyed by it 6295 so that's uh, our turn right there uh, oopsie daisy that is gonna be quite oh looks nice though um, tight 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 but we should be fine yeah oh yes oh yes oh yes alrighty look at that it's a lovely little farm some cows just uh, vibing there Ooh. section here mm. right, I want to get off where's the next stop but look at that we're suddenly not as early as we were before that's why, what I was saying about this map initially gives you an idea that you're way too early and at first you are way too early and then suddenly you are late you find yourself running against time I think it's because uh, given it's basically a straight line I mean it's not really a straight line but you can carry a lot of speed sure it, it just wants you to actually do that you know just speed through the whole thing which uh, it's not very realistic I would assume with this kind of buzz I mean it's not a coach buzz so no seat belts for the passengers I would assume that would offer a lot of risks let's start in there oh boy that was ooh, that was a little bit harsh but now to might have clipped them there did I Oof. don't care at this point oh see Daisy that was terrible oh we have traffic one single car all right great okay let's go moving because gotta make that money in it all right should be stopping here checking there is nobody else so I'm just gonna go and oh yeah look at that all right it is tricky let's try and not clip anything for big buzz that can be quite the challenge you really can Tiptoeing through the city. Let's go. Mm, not bad. I think I didn't clip anything. I could be wrong. It seems to me as if I did not. All right, all right, all right. So we do have. Oh, this part is nice. It is and it is not because we're we're nearing. We're getting late. Oh, we did light now. Oh, okay. Maybe I should have sped up a little bit more. But, oh well. I mean... We 
we're just a little bit late. Being a little bit late is better than being way too early, I guess. But at least, uh, within the game logic, it wouldn't punish you anywhere as much. So, well, look at that. We're carrying that speed now, baby. We're carrying that speed. We have. Do we have people that want to get in? Hello? I think that's a nope. Yep. There's nobody there. Alright. So, shall continue with the trip then. Given there's nobody else, it's the sensible thing to do, you know? It's a sensible thing. Gotta keep on going. Look at that. Ooh, that's a nice, uh, I assume that's a train track that goes over the hill. Right above us. Quite nice. There's one just like that in your truck sim. Maybe it is actually the same one. Probably not, though. Probably not. Wow, look at that. A nice house up there. It's bringing some Italian vibes. Sniper Elite 4. Look at that. Quite nice. Quite, quite nice. Alright. We have to the very tip of the city, the very beginning of Flossenburg, I think. Yeah, we have... Oopsie daisy. Come on, mate. Wait up a little bit. There we go. Alright, again. Welcome aboard our bus. I hope you have a great journey. Because I sure am having a fun ride today. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Let's keep on moving. Let's keep on moving. Uh, yeah. It's a map. Delayed? No way. We're, it's nearing one minute now. That was unexpected. Oh, there's a lot of people. There is a lot of people that want you to get in. Okay, you guys gotta be patient. You, gotta, you guys gotta be very patient now. Let's open the door. All right, that's about right. That's about everyone. Yep. Let's see, let's go. One minute. Quite a nice village, though. Look at that. Looks very comfy, doesn't it? Has this very nice vibe to it. Sorry! Sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I didn't... I was a little bit harsh this time around. They haven't been complaining much though, so... Eh. It's a one-off situation. It was not intended. I just gotta... You have to be very, very calm on the brakes. You gotta really control the footing. 
which uh, can be tricky at times because if you break any any anywhere near what you would consider harsh they complain they are very very sensitive i think oh the stop is right there okay so you have to turn left Let's see so oopsie 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 6295 that's about right door goodbye oh yeah we were too early on two stops ah but it is what it is you know I'm not, I'm not gonna worry about it too much because the important thing is that we got everyone safe in Flossenburg. And that concludes today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Quite a different, for the first time outside of a city environment, you know, an actual road trip. Short, but it's still a road trip. And uh, we managed it quite safely today. Lovely Sitaho, very nice blood. I love it. That was fun. That was really fun. So yeah, I see you guys in the next one. Uh, feedbacks much appreciated. Comment sections right down below. Don't be shy. I I really I really enjoy it when when you guys interact. It's important. So bye bye and until the next one.